In the last video, we talked about how robust Joomla is out of the box. In this video, if you need more, there's more. Joomla helps you build a site your clients will love with over 8,000 extensions. These are being actively developed and constantly updated. If your clients need more than one template or template style on their site, no worries. Joomla can manage that as well. And Joomla gives you complete control over the visual presentation of your site. So seriously, if you need more, there's more. All of the content management systems we cover here at OS Training have extensions. In WordPress, they're called plugins. In Drupal, they're called modules. And in Joomla, they're called extensions. And as I mentioned in the last video, there are five kinds of extensions in Joomla. Components, modules, plugins, templates, and languages. And you can find a lot of them right here. One of the great things about the Joomla extensions directory is that these extensions are vetted and approved. They are not all free, and that's one thing you'll find with WordPress and Joomla. Some extensions are free, and there are some really great free ones. That's some you pay for. And when it comes to paid extensions, I almost always recommend paying for it. If you're a developer, it will help you in the long run. If you're the client that somebody's building a site for you, well, again, the extra power that you get, generally speaking, from these paid extensions is usually worth it. Case in point, Advanced Module Manager and Advanced Template Manager coming from No Number extensions are both absolutely phenomenal. Take a look here at the categories down the left-hand side. You'll see that there are extensions for just about every need. On the main page of the extensions directory, you get random new ones, new and noteworthy, and recently updated extensions. You'll also get random extensions. Honestly, sometimes finding extensions here at the extensions directory is a little bit daunting. I can go through and click on a category and then look at subcategories, but the nice thing that the extensions directory does for me is it gives me popular extensions in this category. And in the calendar category, these five are really, really good. But if we look at our website for just a minute, and I click on the extension manager here, when I first installed Joomla, there was a little button here that said, turn on the install from web tab. And so I click that, and now I have the entire Joomla extensions directory right here in my Joomla site. If I want to find an extension, I can just type in calendar. And Joomla is going to give me all of the calendar extensions available for it. These are listed by popularity, but again, it's always a matter of research and being aware what you're installing on your site. In our Joomla beginner course, we go over how to choose good extensions, and I'd strongly recommend that you take a look at that one again. These are great extensions whether they're free or you need to pay for them. Well, let's find a quick free one. Here's J Events. I'm going to click on J Events, and I'm going to install it. And click Install. It will download the latest version of the extension for me, install it, and put it everywhere it's supposed to go. And when it's done, it gives me a success message. From here, I can just click on Configuration, and just like that, I have a complete calendaring system for my Joomla website. So, if you need more, there's always more. That's just a component. What about the other extensions? Specifically, templates. There are many template clubs for Joomla, and I'm not going to go through a list of them because I don't want to leave somebody out, but there are phenomenal templates for Joomla. And in another video, I'm going to show you how to quickly override templates so that you can have different looks and feels for different sections of your site. So once again, if you need more, there's more.